Hey guys, myself Mukesh, and today I am going to show you how to send mail in PHP using the Gmail. So, without wasting time, let's get started out. So, guys, first you have to download the composer from this URL. Okay, from here you have to download this exe file and install it in your computer. After that, after installation you have to open your command prompt in your command prompt you have to go into your sam folder in a c drive and make the composer directory okay then you have to move into your uh, composer directory and type this command composer require php mailer slash php mailer it will take some time and download the PHP mailer for your PHP version. After the download completion, you have to go into the folder. Okay, in your XAMPP and uh, in a composer folder. Now you can see the vendor directory is created and inside that you can find the PHP mailer. Okay so you have to do copy the vendor folder and uh, you have to paste vendor folder to your php project okay in a ht docs in your project like my project is here is the mail you have to copy the vendor here okay now you have to create a one php file i created index.php where my html form is there and second file is sendmail.php where my mail code is here now we are seeing that index.php file so here guys you can see the whole code is now html code only you can see that form div okay input for the email where and uh, input for the subject and input for the message and one button submit okay now here you can see the form uh, I created is using the bootstrap uh, if you guys want to know how to create the bootstrap form you can visit the w3school.com from where you can learn bootstrap now go to the sendmail.php okay here our action is method is post and action is sendmail.php in the sendmail.php uh, here is the, some syntax for the php mailer you can find uh, it from here readme.md when you open it you can find the whole code from here you can copy the code from here okay and paste in your p sendmail.php okay uh, it extends some namespace uh, using the use keyword and uh, load the autoload.php now here you can see that I am checking the if the is submit submit is setted or not if not setted uh, I am redirected redirect, redirecting to the index.php page if it is setted then I want to send the mail then uh, I write it some code like this I want uh, php mailer uh, object is created uh, and uh, all the attributes of that are set it down like is smtp host is smtp.gmail.com smtp auth is true username you have to write your user gmail id is here and the password for that is here smtp secure is tls port is 587 and here is you can see some type of code this is required when your uh, php is checking open ssl certificate okay then you have to write this in my case it's not checking the open ssl certificate and everything is working fine so i commented out commented out 
if you guys have any problem regarding to the open SSL you can write this one okay then you have to set form your email address and your name then the recipient email ID and the recipient name okay we will get it here from the form page so I write a dollar post email after that uh, is HTML is true and subject the subject name body what you want to send your message your HTML content whatever is come here because here is HTML is true and the uh, alternative body means uh, whoever not uh, support the HTML type they can use a simple text here okay if HTML is supported then this will displayed if not then this will displayed okay mm, then uh, dollar mail signed mail will be sended if successful then this alert message is displayed message has been signed if uh, and then it will redirect it to the our form page index.php if any error occur it will display the alert message message could not send and the mailer error will be displayed okay now we are going to set our gmail id and password things and come back to the again and check the if it is working or not after setting your email address and the password in the sendmail.php you have to uh, open the google and type the less secure app setting and from the less secure app setting you have to on the allow less secure apps okay when uh, after allowing this uh, you have to take care that uh, your email address is not linked anywhere okay uh, email address must be a new then and then the email will be sended otherwise Google will block that okay after that setting uh, you can also comment it out this you can add CC BCC and also you can add attachment in your mail if you want to add an attachment you have to uh, upload the file okay if you want to know how to upload a file in PHP you can watch my video link is given in the description okay you have to upload and save in your server and give a path of that file is here then you can also attach a attachment and then after completing this whole process now we are going to check that this is working or not okay we are going to add the email address and the subject and message in hello okay now we are going to sign the mail okay here you can say that alert messages come with message has been signed okay and form is redirected ok now we are going to check mail is scam or not uh, refresh this you can see that mail ok mail is scam title is demo and the hello is the subject message ok here is the name of mailer name you can type here your name if my video helps you guys then please subscribe my channel and like and share my videos thank you very much for watching my video